welcome back to my channel my name is tina and i am a cameroonian youtuber i get on youtube so i make videos ranging from hair videos to craft videos to me basically spray painting things around and sometimes just sitting in front of the camera and talking as i am right now so if that is something you vibe with and if that's something you're interested in please go ahead and subscribe to and hit the subscribe button so that you can subscribe to my channel also because i love you very much and i don't want you to miss out on any content i will be posting please go ahead and click the notifications bell so that every time i upload you are going to be the first person to be notified with that said i'm going to move on with the video today what's popping people i know that it's quarantine and some people are still in their binge eating mode and everything i still binge eat like yesterday in the middle of the night i wanted to eat miso i don't even know what miso is but i know that it's filling for its sandwich i wanted to eat miso i wanted to eat about the salad i wanted to eat a lot of things so imagine if they were home i would have walked to the fridge and i would have gotten it thank god thank god i do not keep snacks in the house for this very reason so if you're like me you binge eat you stress eat you have gained weight and you want to lose weight this video is the video for you to watch so before you go anywhere please hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell so that you don't miss out on notifications share this video share this video with your friends and leave a comment in the comment section so that i will get to you and we can have a chit chat so thank you so vibe check how are you today how are you doing what is happening to your life what's new what's not new i, I don't know what i'm saying but yeah so today's video i'm going to be talking about my weight loss journey how i was able to lose five kgs in 10 days um so somebody said that it's okay if you're losing let's say two to three kgs every week but for me i was working on a time frame and i actually wanted to look nice in my birthday dress so this the time now was kind of rushed and also because i am a major procrastinator like i put tina in procrastination you get it yeah so i kept on pushing 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 until it was like two weeks to my birthday and then till then i still kept on pushing and finally i had to just look for something that was going to make me not look so bloated in my birthday pictures because i had intentions of going out and taking nice pictures which i still didn't even do so <laughs> joke is on me but anyways you're here for the video and that's what i'm going to give to you right now okay so i don't know if you're like somebody looking to lose weight one of the channels that i always go to is versatile vicky because all of her diets work like i have tried a couple of her diets and yes they work they, they're like so if if vicky posts something and she's like oh just drink water and swallow air for the next couple of days for this i will literally do it because i trust her and she makes a lot of sense so the diet i tried from her was the egg diet and <laughs> boy let me tell you the diet was uh <laughs> um i don't even know what to say because that diet had me in ways that i could not even explain so the diet is you're supposed to eat two eggs and green tea in the morning you're supposed to eat two two eggs yeah two eggs and green tea in the morning and then you're supposed to eat two eggs and an apple in the afternoon and then in the evening you're supposed to eat an apple and a bowl of oatmeal in the evening so first thoughts on the diet when i said i was like yeah sure i can do it. is it to no it's three eggs sorry for the misinformation it's three 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 and then nothing in the evening and then all throughout you're going to drink green tea so when i first saw the diet i was like haha i can do this i can do this because I don't like exercising not that I don't like exercising but going to the gym is a whole different level of commitment that I I don't know if I'm ready for it yet so till then I will do diets every two to three weeks it's not really like diets it's basically just controlling because it was a 900 calorie diet so it's basically just controlling what you put into your body which is also great so for the diet i didn't actually follow it to a t because i also do intermittent fasting and every time I, my window my eating window is from 12 to 8 so if i say let 
let's say I take breakfast at 8 o'clock and I have uh, the green tea and three eggs by 2 o'clock I'll be taking lunch um, or 2 to 4 and uh, like to, between 2 p.m. and 4 p.m. I'll be taking lunch and that's another three eggs for me it was just a lot to digest and also because I go to school so sometimes when I leave school when I leave the house that morning I only come back like later in the evening and in the evening I will have to digest like four eggs at once so I cut it down to two eggs and Versata Vicky says you shouldn't cut it down like you should eat the required amount and I tried to google it to see what was going to happen if I only had like 600 calories a day and they weren't really saying much it wasn't very helpful like Cora I don't want to say the word but you know what I'm thinking of so yeah um so I ate two eggs in the morning I ate two eggs in the afternoon and then I ate my oatmeal at night for this diet the one thing I was always looking forward to was the night because um, you had to eat the eggs just boiled and not that, that. I'm, I'm African and I'm Cameroonian and I don't think there's anybody in Africa or Cameroon who will just sit down and be digesting eggs just like that we always have to have the spicy pepper and I'm not talking about dry pepper I'm talking about like actual pepper and onion and seasoning and everything that goes into making food great so it's quite tasty when you eat it so for me it was kind of difficult because I was just there chucking down eggs and also during that period there was a lot of festivities going on so I kept on pushing it also because today I will get tempted and I will eat this and I'll be like Oh, let me google how much a foot of chicken is uh, like the calories and I'm going to separate it from like what I had that day so if I tasted if I broke my diet and I ate a foot of chicken I will not eat the two eggs and that was basically what I was doing which is wrong by the way because you're not supposed to dedicate I mean you're not supposed to go that long if you can try five days five days five days so that at the end of the day you're not like missing out you're not starving yourself too much that is going to work better for you anyways moving on so that was like kind of uh what was not it for me so in the evening i was really looking forward to having the oatmeal and the apple so basically it's four spoons of oatmeal milk and honey and cinnamon and apple and i ate it like that was some gourmet dish or something like that was the most fanciest dish I've ever eaten because honestly like the whole diet was just depressing like uh, I will wake up in the morning and I'll boil my eggs and then I'm carrying a bowl of eggs to sit down everybody is munching spaghetti Everybody is munching spaghetti, everybody is eating indomie, people are eating pizza, people are drinking this, people are drinking that. And then I'm just sitting here with my two boiled eggs looking at me. So it was quite depressing, I'm not going to lie, I did not enjoy that part of the diet. But let's move on to like how I did do it. So I ended up doing the diet for nine days because I remember I had this paper where I always mark and that's how I stay motivated during my diet. I have this paper where I will tick day one, tick day two, tick day three. And, and I end up doing three, I end up, sorry, I end up doing eight days of the diet. And my birthday was supposed to be day nine of the diet, uh, sorry, nine days of the diet. My birthday was supposed to be day 10 of the diet. But that morning, before I could even do, you know, like when you did diet and then you come and do before and after picture. Before I could even do the before picture, I was so hungry that morning. Like, I woke up and I was like, I should eat somebody's head. And I think somebody had delivered pastries or what in the house. So I just went and I, like, put my face in it and I ate. <laughs> so I, yes, my belly may be a little bit bloated because also I don't eat before 10 am because i'm trying not to get bloated and i'm trying not to want to use the bathroom when i go into somebody's house when i'm busy during the day so that's basically it so for the diet uh now i'm going to move to the pros and cons of the diet as i've explained throughout this whole video what i really loved about the diet is how it was easy for me to do there wasn't a lot of preparing i have tried to do the 
cabbage soup diet and honestly i could not pull through because you have to either cook the cabbage soup every two days or cook it every day and it was not working for me i know how people are like you should cook every day i don't cook every day i don't like cooking cooking i do like cooking but only as like something therapeutic but not something that i will be mandated to do every day it doesn't even it's i'm sorry but that's just the way i am it's, it's just something that i'm not comfortable with so yeah so um one of the pros what when you say pros and cons oh my god wow okay so i'm going to do it like good and bad you know your brain has like a momentary lapse where everything just goes dark that's what i'm <laughs> that's what i'm experiencing right now but for the pros and cons i i think pros is what you like and then cons is what you don't like in case i'm mixing it up because my brain is really dead right now so what i liked about the diet is how it was accessible it was very cheap i didn't spend too much money i didn't have to do special diets or what it was just basically eggs and pepper and then some green tea so it was very very cheap and uh, then again it was easy like you could do it on the go i mean like you're basically you could eat oatmeal where if you travel uh you could just buy eggs because i remember this one that was out of doubt the whole day and i ended up having to just buy eggs and just eat where i was i didn't have to come home for that so you could easily assess it and it was quite easy how easy it was for me to control my appetite clause it was very feeling when whenever i ate it was i was full i did not feel hungry it was very satisfying and it also kind of helped me with portion control because when i stop this diet when i take a big plate of food i'll be like no my stomach cannot hold that in so i'm going to just leave the rest of the food so that was great for me um for the cons still again i'm confused but what i hated about the diet is it was boring like 10 days of 9 to 10 days of continuously eating one and the same thing which is not even spicy or flavored or anything it was really boring now i'm going to go ahead and see what you have all been waiting for did i actually lose 10 kgs no because the diet says you lose 10 kgs in 10 days no i did in total I did in total lose 5 kgs of weight and for me that was great because it was something that I was looking forward to so yes I did get like a tiny part of my waist snatched and the goal is to keep doing it for as long as you can do it for so yes I'm going to go ahead and try other diets and yes I'm going to go ahead and still do this and follow it to the T because she said that if you don't follow it you're not going to get results I did get results though but now I'm going to try it following it to the T and hopefully that is going to get much more better with time so that's basically it for this video if this helps you in any way I'm going to link the video where she does the explanation and everything down below so that you go and watch it but again if this helps you in any way and if you like what you listened and watch please subscribe please share with your friends i would love that very much i'm very grateful also don't forget to watch the ad so that i can make some shmoney <laughs> uh so that's basically it for this video thank you very much for watching i love you guys as always and i will see you in my next video